What is up guys, this is me Johnny Cooper 64 here with another YouTube video and Crash Bandicoot is getting more merchandise. Kid Robot who is known to make vinyl figures and lots of apparel are making Crash Bandicoot vinyl figures. Now these are actually a mystery pack which means that when you get them you don't know which figure you're going to be getting because you know they're a mystery and you know that kind of sucks if you get the same one you bought before. The description of these figures is say, Yeehaw, Crash is back and he's enhanced and trance and ready to dance. Kid Robot who is ready to rock with everyone's favorite Bandicoot in an all new Mini series joined by Coco Bandicoot, Aku Aku, Uka Uka, and Dr. Neo Cortex. Crash Bandicoot is ready to take an old school PlayStation punch for your collection. Grab all eight today and put some ump in your womp. Anyways, let's take a look at these figures. Now, over here we have a normal version of the Crash Bandicoot figure. Over here we have a Dr. Neo Cortex with that evil smile. And we have the cross eyed version of the Crash Bandicoot figure. We have Aku Aku looking amazing as well, and as you can see, there's something holding Aku Aku as in the game he floats. And the same goes with Uka Uka, the real antagonist of the Crash Bandicoot series. Then we have Crash Bandicoot's sister, Coco Bandicoot, which looks the weirdest out of all of them in my opinion, but she still looks amazing. Then we have Aku Aku in Crash Bandicoot's face, which represents the invincible Crash power-up. Now that's really cool, but I wish they also made one for Dr. Neocortex with Uka Uka as well. Because, you know, Uka Uka possesses Dr. Neocortex a lot in Warped. So that would have been amazing to add it as well. And then we have the secret figure, which could be Jetpack Crash, Biker Crash, or Fake Crash. Who knows? These figures will cost $8.99 each, and as I said before, you get a random figure, so you have to choose wisely. The figure will be releasing in June 2018, which marks the first anniversary of the release of Insane Trilogy. What figures are you guys going to be getting? Which figures do you guys like to see getting made next? Let me know in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.